In this video, I'll walk you through how to install R, RStudio, and Radiant on a Mac. So we're in the Math and Stats Bootcamp site. As you know, there's a few cases here. Once you get to case number five, that talks about exploring data. Scroll down in that, and you'll see reference to Radiant, which is a tool that you'll use in your business analytics class and a few other classes in your MBA program as well. Scroll down a bit more, and you'll see a link to the install instructions. So let's click on that. And we see a command to run for Windows and one for Mac OS. It says to install R, RStudio and Radiant on Mac OS, copy and paste the command below into a terminal and press the return key. All right, so there's a nice copy button here. So we'll use that. And then we'll go into applications and launch pad and type in terminal and that opens a terminal. So I'll make it a bit bigger here. I'm just going to go ahead and paste in the command that we just got from the install page and press the return key. So the first thing it's going to do is download R and try to install that. And so it will need a, a password for that. And so I'm going to go ahead and type that in. And so this is your own password for your computer. And you'll notice that as I was typing, it didn't look like anything was being entered, but it is. And so just again, type in your password and press return. And then it'll start installing R, then it'll start downloading R Studio. And so that'll take a second, depending on the speed of your network connection. Almost done, there we go. All right, so now it's gonna go ahead and install RStudio. And now it's gonna start installing Radiant and some of its dependencies, and so it's downloading those. And installing them. And now the last step in the install process is to download and install a tool called Tiny Tech. This isn't critical, but still useful in case you want to create some PDF reports from your statistical or data analysis. So again, that'll take a second for it to download. And there we go, the installation is complete. And so now it says, next steps, open up our studio from the applications folder. In our studio, go to the add-ins dropdown and you can start our studio. Or if, if for whatever reason that doesn't work, you can copy and paste this command. And then once you run that, you should see Radiant open in your web browser. All right, so let's go back into our launch pad and let's type in our studio. There we go, there's our studio, which was just installed. It's gonna open up. And let's see if we click on the add-ins dropdown. There it is. Let's go ahead and start Radiant. Right, and so this is the Radiant application. So you'll see some data on diamond prices. If you want to know a little bit more about Radiant just to get started, you can look in case number five. And there's a video to introduce you to Radiant. And then we'll have a session, uh, a Radiant workshop uh, as part of orientation as well. 